different greens in here and it's easy just to splodge one amongst all the greens. Let's try and capture some of those. get some of those down and then right on the shoreline there there's a lovely little patch of brilliant green which I capture now and let's get all of those there's a patch of green green grass just here that Dark green is waiting to bleed into it, but that's also okay. It's reflected a bit. Let's just lift that little dot there so that when I join them up, they don't just become dark. There's a, sh a narrow shelf of rock just along the shoreline here, which I always capture like that. And as the wind picks up and drops the, the colours in the water, just change radically. So there's, there's no telling what's going to happen next. So we'll just capture what's there when we get there. Here's the little beach. Okay. It's more in yellow in colour. Doesn't really matter. And then... The water here is a very yellow colour against the sand. There's some and you can just see the colour of the, the bottom of the river where there's a reflection from the mountain and the rest is all sky. So let's just capture that like, like that. And there's, hmm, I'm quite sure to do that, but we'll just do a mixture like that. Soften that edge. And let's let that dry. 